There it goes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What happened last week, guys? Man. Cyberpunk. But well, last week, uh, Vivian interrogated uh, Glass. Uh, got some information out of him. Glass? Not as much as she probably would have liked, but enough. Um... Glass? Found Who's out glass? that we. Is it Gale. 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 <laughs> I don't know. Um, yeah. I'm like, does he have like a cool nickname now? <sighs> he does now. He's Mr. Glass. Uh, it's copyright. We can't. We can't use that one. The, He's um, so breakable. We can't. No, we can't. Do- <laughs> <laughs> um, and found out that location alpha is where we thought it was. Um, that, uh, Elena is in fact the AI that was released, but is likely a copy of the Elena that we currently have, um, and has been alone without any kind of interaction for some time, which is quite possibly why she went a little crazy and wants to destroy everything. Hold on a second. Patrick, Um, can you throw your headphones on? Thank you. Continue. And, uh, yeah, so that's why she wants to go, or why she went a little crazy, wants to destroy everything. Uh, she was also a, like, top-level, probably best programmer he's ever seen. Uh, so taking her down, he had been working pretty much round the clock to try and keep her at bay. And now he's been gone for some time, because we have him. Uh, so yet another thing that we apparently screwed up. Um... So we came up with the brilliant idea to take the Elena who is nice that we have because we were able to talk to her from the time that she came into existence um, and ask her to fight the other Elena with us to try and take her down. Uh, We have now gone to Gail's apartment to try and find some way to log in to the mainframe because that's where he's been working out of so he must have some way to log in there i'm not a computer person so these words probably don't make sense um or aren't the correct ones uh zigzag vivian and seeker snuck into the apartment to try and locate something we did find the room where he had been logging in seeker is currently locked in there by herself because uh dredge and monkey came in and realized that there were some folks uh coming to get us and they made it to the floor and they're trying to currently break into uh greg's apartment and i think it was monkey stabbed someone or dredge stabbed someone right when they were getting out of the elevator monkey yeah that'd be mono Mm -hmm. so that's where we are uh about to start a wicked fight with some people who want to kill us uh because we fucked a lot of things up Yeah, you're not wrong. I mean, we fucked some shit up. It's, 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 no mm-hmm. That's all on it us. It was at that moment that he had realized yeah. he had fucked up. <laughs> okay. What happens when they don't, you know, you don't have all the information, you know? Yep. Here we go. Let me go ahead and pop the map. And it's going to work my face. <gasps> <laughs> Okay, so you're gonna you're gonna be a dick here. Chords, you're gonna be a dick. It's okay if it's you know a little bit askew. It's okay. Well, I'd prefer it not to be, but a little bit. Of okay, it's so up. let me I'll give you the lay of the land in case you don't remember. Elevator, lobby area, actual entrance to the uh, condo slash apartment. This is a bit of a mudroom, leading into a living room slash kitchen, in which Vivian and Zigzag are way in the fucking back, behind two large pillars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they are. And I've uh, so labeled. We I've labeled. <laughs> Pants totally cut down. 
by a bunch of fucking spooks in a fucking elevator. Let me go. For once, Mono made the first move. I was shocked. I didn't even know. That man, how number to two, the situation. Number two, I have not. Na- I have numbered everyone for simplicity's sake. Number two currently has twelve points of damage attached to him. And uh, he's got a set of wolvers uh, still in his side, by the way, holding him up like a, like a human shield because. That's no, it was he ten, is. wasn't it? It was ten, not twelve. Well, yeah. I think it was ten. Ten, I, ten will work. Fine. I forgot to add my body modifier. Oh, we can add your body modifier. What's your body modifier? Six, because of feet of strength, so total would be 16 points of damage on him. Okay, so I need to probably re uh, I never rolled his body uh, for his death save, because that dude probably gonna die. <laughs> He's a meat One shield. down. Hey bars, do me a favor in uh, in chat. If uh, let us know how the audio sounds. If I'm too low or if somebody else is too low, let us know. I'm trying to figure this out. He hasn't named them. This is definitely a combat encounter. True. The um. There you go. That's, um, okay, he is not passed out or dead. (laughs) He is simply skewered. First round, initiative, go. Oh, shit. Okay. Initiative. Is a 1d10 plus reflex, plus or minus mods. <laughs> You're doing the get video game if thing you If you could sing all the rules, that would make it so much easier for all of us. <laughs> oh my god, totally. 1d10 plus reflex. Patrick, your dice roller hates me. It hates me. Specifically me. Sorry. Well, I also rolled a 1 on initiative. 13 and I'm my my font is not as good cool as yours damn it what happened oh. okay Two, like I was saying I couldn't believe Milo made the first move what was yours my dumb ass is just there holding the ladder I will write them here in order that they appear on screen. Uh, Dredge. Uh, I rolled a one, which results in a ten. So, one. Uh, Laura? I also rolled a one. But... Which resulted in a six. So... Mm-hmm. <laughs> wow. So you, rolled, you rolled a one and it didn't give you the wah, wah, wah? I didn't. Uh, I didn't download the new version. Oh, okay. Or I downloaded the new version, but I didn't switch to using it because the numbers weren't working for me. Okay. Um, zigzag. Thirteen. Thirteen. There's a number, and monkey. Also thirteen. Thirteen. Wow! Great job. They wrote a nine. <laughs> there you go. Okay. So, um, whoever has the highest reflex uh, may take their turn first. Technically, they happen at the same time, but I'm going to let you do all your stuff, and then we'll do whatever. That'd be you, Zig. I only have a reflex of six. <clears throat> yeah, mine's eight. That so, would be you, Philip. Yeah, no, so you're... upon hearing uh, monkeys and, and, and Dredge's voices, I decide it's probably time to move up. Instead of hiding my ass behind a pillar. You also probably hear a ah! loud yell of some sort. Right, right. Coming so from I'm the man the getting his the door. They're probably a little distracted, so I probably have some sort of advantage moving in there without necessarily being seen too much. Okay. So uh, how close do you think I can get to him? Well, to cover the room. Oh, wait. I, yeah, I'm a ways away. 
You yep. have a movement stat, and you, you can do use that to stat. select the number of squares you move. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's listed under M A. Which yeah, that's four. <laughs> okay. All right, so you can move up four. So one, two, th three, four. All right. How's uh, that? And. Yeah, and I'm looking at the layout here. Uh, five and six push through into the room? No, these are, they're all still in the lobby. Literally the only person you could possibly have a shot on is three because this door was kind of broken in, right, if you remember. But it's sitting on a pile of shit that you put in front of it. Each square is five feet, right? Each square is a meter. A meter, yeah. Okay. Um, it's how they so do that. I don't know. So that actually puts me in close range. It, yeah, I guess it does. Okay. Um, they will have um, minus two. They they will have... Uh, you will get minus two because they're in, this guy is in slight cover. Okay? Yeah, All right. So uh, let's see. I'm looking at this. Close range. That puts me with the total skill of uh, eight. Modifier minus two. You said minus two? Yes. So that's six. So I basically need uh, to not roll a... Oh, no, I want to do an aim shot, by the way. Aim shot so that... Uh, aim shot is... Um, what is that? It adds a negative one. That can't be right. You're aiming for a particular body part. Oh, headshot. Yeah. Headshot. Yeah. So it's, it's minus four to go for yeah, a headshot. Yeah, minus four. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Okay, so since I'm that close, since I've got telescopic sight yeah, and smart Yeah, it's dependent gun, on body parts, right. Hooked onto it. That's a negative four. Uh, so basically, I have to roll a... Three to hit him in the head. Okay. Roll three. Holy shit, snacks. My number is not changing. Hold on. Four. Roll. Twelve. Yeah. All right. So that doubles the damage. Okay. So the damage my gun does is a. Uh, Two dice six plus three. So that's going to be four dice six plus six. But zigzag, that kills people. Thank you, Bars. That's been Zig's job. So, uh, 21 points of damage. Uh, all right. Uh, minus, he is wearing a helmet. Um, yeah, now it's got to get through. So how much was it? And his 21. Body. 21. And his, body. and his body modifier. But okay. he still has to roll for stun, though, since it was a headshot. Yes, he does. Keep grabbing the wrong marker. Let's put this over there. The uh, three. He pretty much has to roll for stun regardless. Um, and he is... He was knocked down. Yeah, he's knocked down and stunned. You you just see him drop, by the way, Zigzag. As All a right. character. Uh, you two inside the elevator, you would see shots ring out through the now cracked door. Hitting... One of the um, armored individuals. Nice. Let me get that. Oh, I need that. Okay. Okay. All right.
Okay. Um, next up is uh, Monkey. I uh, continue. I leave my Wolvers inside this dude, and I'm using him as a human shield. Okay. As I rush, uh, you know, full on into number six there, uh, attempting to uh, use this guy basically as a battering ram to knock this guy down. So that will be a, we'll call it, um, I'm just going to take a grapple, probably a, well, I guess first, do you want me to roll this to, to first grapple number two? Um, y- yes. Uh, he will be at severe disadvantage due to the fact that he's heavily injured. Okay, grapple will be brawling. My brawling is cool. <clears throat> so 17 to grapple. Absolutely, you can push him. Excellent. And that will also be brawling. We'll call that essentially a... What do we call that? Basically, I'm hitting that guy with, yeah, a, with an we'll guy. call it. we'll call it a... Thank you. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I'm going to hit you with your own pimp. The, um, uh, we're going to... Consider this a uh, a. We do it as another, just a tackle, another. Grapple. Yeah, a non-damage because I don't think you would actually do any damage doing this. Yeah. The hope is just to knock him on his ass. So, all right, um, rolling for that. Uh, Seventeen again. And that guy's. Yes, you, you're able to knock him down basically onto this um, double-sided couch that he's sitting behind. So I'm going to put him over here. Okay, you're here. Yep. Push that guy up here. I still have the the number two in front of me. Uh huh. Using as a human shield. I mean, two, five, and six. Yes, four and three. Less so. Indeed, indeed. And that is my turn. Here I can. I'll put you more like right there. Um, okay, uh, they get to go, um, the number one will immediately try to, uh, smack Dredge with the butt of his gun, which will be melee. That is um, 20 versus your, I think. Um, hand-to-hand attack kind of thing? Yeah, it's melee. So, yeah, you could use um, versus your, um, uh, I'll just say versus your melee. Uh, okay. So reflex you're... plus skill plus your one d10 with yes. Yeah. This is a really okay. It's thing against. It's against my reflex plus my melee, plus body type, right? No. Mm, not body type. Body type. Just no, no body type. My, my There's. We just told you what it was. Body it's, type it's, modifiers it's, just on damage. Got it. It's reflex melee plus a d10. Damage or to resist damage. Okie dokie. So that's just... Uh, I don't have melee as a skill. So it's just reflex plus a d10. Okay. You rolled a 20. So 14 succeeds. Um, strike. Their body is... Am I reading correct? Body type modifier for his body six is zero, monkey. Uh, that mm-hmm. 
Yes, that is correct. Okay, he hits you for three. Okay, that will not pass my body and stopping power. Okay, it will hit you in the chest. Um, you need to roll stun real quick, but it does knock one point off your armor and your chest. What do I roll for stun? Uh, it's a body roll. roll. So roll a d10. Um, you need to get lower than whatever your body is with a modifier of zero. Oh, okay, okay. Lower than my body. Yep. I don't know why it's lower for this one specific thing, but it's lower for this one specific thing. Death saves and stun saves. You have to get lower it's than whatever harder, your body is. the higher your body type is? No, it's easier. No, because, yeah, because then you've got body type modifiers that subtract from the roll. Yeah. So, like, my body type is, I have an 8, so I get to subtract 3 from any body type roll that I make. So, if she rolls a 9, she actually gets a 6, so it's under her body type. Mm-hmm. Okay, so it's, basically, I'm adding my body type modifier to my roll. Mm-hmm. Just the modifier, not the total. Okay, let me figure that out. So I think that's a plus two for me. Should be minus two. Uh, Five. Ended up being a total of seven. Okay. Yeah. Wait, that, plus. Two? No, it's minus. It's reversed. It's so it'd be uh, it would be a three, and you succeed that. He does not knock you down. The um. Okay. Okay. Uh, you do need to not take one off of your chest armor, however, permanently. Yep. Okay. Um, next up is two. He's going to try to re- remove himself from your grapple. Hopefully without killing himself <laughs> in the process. Um, so that is, uh, brawling, which is going to be a total of ten. Versus your brawling, sir? That is not successful. Okay. That means I'm going to let you roll for Wolvers because he damage specifically because he is struggling against... Struggling against the three spiky things in the side of his, in the side of his chest. That's great. Mm-hmm. So I'm going to go ahead and roll... Uh, um, I'm not going to add my my body modifier because it's not me doing. Yeah, you're not doing it. So it's just a straight um, 3d6, which is uh, eight total. Oh, sorry. Wait, I did that wrong. Let me re-roll that. This game was made. Did worse that. (laughs) That's good. I did. So five damage that he caused himself. I need to roll death save again. <laughs> Shit. Stop move. What are you doing? Stop. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, he kills himself. <laughs> and he, fall, he oh. falls off, yeah. <laughs> so two is just lying on the ground there. And we're going to put... Because uh, there are certain mechanics, I'm going to put it sideways, dictating that he is. I get it. I down. Get it. Um, it's not like D and D, where the video game just magically makes them apparate. And <laughs> that's only if you have the hide corpses option on. <laughs> um, Would you allow me to hold up his limp ass body weight? Or no? Uh, roll. You beat him in brawling, so yeah, I'll give it to. You. Cool, and I'm yes, I'm just holding. He basically didn't him. get away from your grapple, so you didn't let him go. So yeah. Okay, cool. So he is basically my cover. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that will matter. They have they have armor. They uh, um. Okay. Smart. Uh, one, two, three. Three needs to roll stun save. 
Uh, he uh, remains stunned. Four is going to try to help three up. Which be under. Which one has the drill? That was three. Three? Okay. Yeah. Four is providing medical assistance to three because he got shot in the fucking head. <laughs> Five is going to shoot at monkey. Sorry, monkey. Attempt to. This will be a called shot trying to shoot around the person you're holding. So that's at a minus... Fucking weapons. <sighs> okay. Being in this game is a lot like, um, uh, Savage Worlds. It's just like if you hit that number, you hit. But then there's so much math. Shit, so much math. Right? Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. and the damage mm -hmm. is what's actually stopped by stuff instead of it. Instead yeah. Of the, to hit. Stuff, so. Which actually does make sense when you think about it from like you're trying to real yeah, do a realistic yeah. standpoint wrapping, sort of wrapping thing. Your head around it starts to make. make more okay, sense. so it's, this will hit around the guy. Um. It's a 24, so that will hit. Okay. Um, 2d6 plus 3 is going to be a um, 9. Take it versus your torso armor. Um, my cover. Got to count that first. No, he was trying to shoot around him because he still thinks he's alive. Okay. Um, so, so I did the minus four. I did the minus four on his shot. Okay. What did, what did he call shot? Uh, was it an arm shot or a torso shot? Torso or? shot. He's trying to get. Torso. He's trying to get torso. So yeah. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Um, that does not make it through my armor. Okay. So m knock one off your armor, and then uh, we'll continue. Dig it. Okay. Six. He needs to stand up. Does he do that? <laughs> yeah, okay. He's able to stand up. He will... Um, and that's all he's going to do this round. Okay. Um, next up is Dredge. All right. Uh, man, uh, I'm just... I know... Mon will never forgive me if I don't use this mechanic. I got to use the ladder. So um, <laughs> my first reaction is I, I, I take that ladder and I throw it straight ahead of me to try and knock over two or sorry, knock over one and possibly three, depending on how it goes. OK, so that's <laughs> OK. So we're going to call this a melee attack. Um, OK. Uh, it will be at minus one for improvised because this is not something you're used to and it's unwieldy as all hell. Okay. You think I don't, I'm not used to throwing ladders. Okay. You're totally right. I'm not used to throwing ladders. <laughs> who, who would throw a ladder? Honestly, the, uh, <laughs> okay. So you're throwing it at three, four, five. Is that what I'm thinking? Uh, no, I was, I was throwing, I was trying to knock back one and three. So it's like, we're thinking like, I'm throwing it like just. So you're I'm throwing it at directly one. From, you're throwing it at one. Yeah. Is basically what you're doing and hoping uh -huh. it, that it causes something. Okay. So yeah, go ahead and roll melee. All right. 
Do you want me to take those penal? You want me to take that penalty out right before the roll? Yeah, just throw a minus one on it. Or, yeah. Fourteen. That uh, does not beat their twenty-six. Um, it, he knocks the ladder out of the way. It lands on the floor. All right. Well. Um, so yeah, that didn't work. I'm gonna use my movement to draw my weapon, and that's the end of my turn. Okay. Um, Vivian. Oh, okie dokie. Um, she also feels as though perhaps she shouldn't be hiding behind a pole. Um, I can't see the top of the map. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Um, I don't want to pull it out too far. It becomes useless. No, yeah. Um, she'll come down the side, kind of hugging the wall. Over here? Yeah. Okay. Um... In his nice kitchen, he's got recessed appliances on the left wall. They're very nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All the stainless steel. My movement is three, so I will only... I'll just sort of move diagonally to One, get there. One, two, three. There you go. Mm-hmm. Um. You don't really have a shot on anything. Yep, I don't have a shot at anything, so that's where I'll be. Just okay. Sort of. All right. Uh, hey, congratulations, guys. We've done one round of combat. Monkey, continue. <laughs> you know, that honestly didn't take as long as I thought it would. <laughs> um, is it Zig's turn or mine? It's like 20 minutes. Uh, uh, Zig, sorry. Yeah. Uh, in a crouching position, I uh, move even closer to the door. Uh, okay. I see that little partition there. I might use that as some uh, kind of cover there. Right, right here? There. Yeah. Uh, from that vantage point, what can I see? Um, probably not much of anything. Four is crouched down, helping three. Um, you probably hear a shitload. You know what I mean? Okay, was that my full movement then? Yes, it was. All right. Uh, if I can't see anything, I can't shoot at anything. So uh, I guess that's the end of my turn. Okay. Um, monkey. You can move three times your movement as an action, like as a sprint, but you just don't have an action after that. Right. So I'd rather hold on to my next action by moving two and being able to shoot right out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I should put a bunch of shit in the way. Um, There's a bunch of shit in the way here. I'll make... There's magazines uh, with stuff in them. (laughs) I guess I will lunge at um, number six, uh, leading with my wolvers. Okay. And we'll see if I can embed... uh... So, first thing I'm going to need you to roll is I'm going to need you to roll in athletics because this is a double-sided couch, and if you fall flat on your face... I'm I'm jumping over the couch. Jumping over, climbing over, you know what I mean. It's not steady, super steady footing, and you're trying to be aggressive. All right. So, that's essentially just a reflex roll? Yes, and I will put it uh, at a simple 10. All right, let's see how I do. Well. There you go. You do it just fine. Okay, so you may roll brawling as per normal. Uh, leading with my wolvers, so that would, wouldn't that be melee? Or what do you want brawling? Whichever you would prefer. Okay. Sure, you can do melee. I mean, that makes sense to me. Fuck it. <laughs> Not great. These um, are these are rules. So these are relaxed rules. Separate stats. Yeah, yeah. Everything separate stats, dude. This fucking game's got so many goddamn stats. Yep. Not great. Um, just a twelve. Okay. Um, that is versus. That will still do two. Okay. Um, and they do not need to roll anything. Um, okay. Uh, their turn. Uh, six is going to try to hit you back. So you're super on top of him for shooting, right? Indeed, yep. 
Uh, so this is brawling. Um, that is a 21. Versus yours, brawl, your brawling, sir. Eighteen. So. Eighteen. Did you, on the damage, uh, add your body modifier? By the way, you told me to remind you. Um, haven't haven't done any damage yet. To six. Oh, to six. Yeah. Um, I, um, I did not. So that'd be another six. Another six. Sorry. No, you're fine. I'm just trying to keep everything straight so we're doing it correctly. Yep, you too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Okay. <laughs> All right. I just uh, have ball and blitz stuck in my head. So it hit you? Yes? Yes, he did hit me. Okay. That is a uh, two damage is all. Um, okay. Takes a swing at you, hits you, but you're a big boy. Just angers me more than anything. <laughs> okay. Uh, five is going to shoot. I'm sorry. Point blank. Uh, he just basically uh, has to pull the trigger. Yeah, he hits. Um. <laughs> he had to get a. It's point blank. He has to get a ten. The yeah. where? That's the question. Sick. Uh, it'll be center mass. That's how they're trained. Uh, six total damage. All right. Awesome. That did not make it through my armor. Knock another point off your torso armor. Yep. My torso is well well protected. As long as they keep trying to shoot me there, I'm fine. Got okay. to aim for the chest. It's the only way to kill me. Aim for the heart. Or the face. I think the face would probably work, too. Well, that, yeah, I don't want them to know that. <laughs> I know I'm not there, but don't help them, monkey. They don't need your help to figure out how to kill you. I'm not there. It's just a strange voice in your head appears. He's British <laughs> for some reason. Four is, is uh, done helping three. He's going to... Uh, shoot at monkey because monkey is basically t rip tearing through this fucking room right now <laughs> as stretch has a ladder fight in the elevator the uh <laughs> what do you mean throwing a ladder didn't draw aggro <laughs> <laughs> ineffectively throwing a ladder did not draw aggro um that's a So that's 15, so I'm just going to get a, yeah. Still. Just because mine was going all Logan on their asses doesn't mean they can ignore me. <laughs> uh, it hits. It'll be torso. Okay. That is um, seven. That also does not make it through my armor. No, this is dredge. Oh, this is dredge. Okay, cool. No, monkey, Change sorry. Your mind. I just told you, it was, I just said it was monkey. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. So, okay, seven. Okay, cool. I was just complaining about it not being me. What the fuck? All of a sudden... Just, it's like taking little punches to the to my gut. Three... Three actually gets his shit together. And he is going to blind fire out the door. Knowing that's where he was shot from. That is crazy. I did not see that shit coming. So, <laughs> bit of a spray and pray. It's at a crazy negative. Um, yeah. Okay. It, it misses, but bullets whiz by you, zigzag. Okay. What? They chunk in the counter, they chunk in the wall next to you, they chunk in the table behind you, but let them hit you. Okay. Um, 
And then did one go yet? I, don't, I honestly don't remember. I don't, I don't believe so. so. I don't believe so. No, he did not. Okay. And he is going to... Do you see the size of that cannon? We should be dead. He's going to kick your ass. Brawling. <clears throat> Nine. Opposed 11. by my brawling. Yeah. Eleven total. Did terrible job there. Um, unless I crit fail, there's no way he gets me. Which you're still capable of doing. That's 26. Okay. Um, so that moves on. Monkey, we're back to you. Nope, nope, that's not true. Now we're now we're at Dredge. <laughs> <laughs> no, yep. Dredge, Viv, and then Zig again. Sorry, lightning didn't strike twice, Mono. Count the shells, sucker duck. <laughs> okay, this is point blank. Yeah. So point blank, um, I'm going to empty the clip. So that's a plus two. Okay. Um, bonus for point blank. Uh, you have to make a 10. Yeah. Oh, it's just what I have to make. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, the, the, it's set based on your range for whatever weapon you're at. You gotta be fist fucking me. Fourteen. Ah, uh, that's a no. That's a fucking one. Okay, roll, roll ten again. No modifiers. You gotta get at least a six. It's a ten. Okay, so you're fine. You somehow totally miss him point blank because you shoot into this, unload into the ceiling, trying to dodge him kicking you. <laughs> Real struggle busting over there, bud. The, uh. Uh, Vivian. Yes. Okay. I'm still up there. No one has broken into the room yet. No, and they I can see all the ship kicked off, and they were still trying to figure out how to get through Zigzag's barricade. Mm-hmm. And I can see Zig by the door. I know what my strengths are, so I'm gonna stay where I'm at because shooting is not my strength, and nobody's there for me to kick or punch. So I'm gonna stay cover. Where okay. Sounds good. Uh, now we are back to Zigzag. All right, what can I see? Well, you saw the one dude stand back up with a totally fucked up helmet and shoot fire back into the room. You saw that. All right, so uh, I'm basically within a, uh, not quite a meter. So uh, still close range. Still an aim shot at his head. And uh, basically I need a three to hit him. <laughs> Okay, point blank, yeah. And I rolled a three. <laughs> Excellent. Congratulations. Um, okay, roll damage. Twenty-two. Wow. Okay, then. That guy's not having a good day. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see how this guy lives, actually. <laughs> That's two fucking headshots. I mean, within moments. That's just, yeah. <laughs> so, like, so I, uh... It's actually... I, one, two, <laughs> three, four... Five. Uh-oh. We're about to have crazy dog sirens. Okay. With a minus eight, he will try to succeed on his body save. He rolled a three. He did not succeed. Ended up with an 11. Their body is six. So this dude, he's, he'll oh, get him up. <laughs> well, let, let's do a, let's do an overreacted death. <laughs> no, Let's he's see, a, a overreacted. What does that mean? 
it's just overacted. There's not a second <laughs> R in it. Okay. Oh, overacted. You're right. Yeah, there's a there's a chart on that uh, combat summary. That if I were to roll a four, he uh, clutches the wound, staggers, then falls. He does the Wilhelm scream. Uh, I... Yeah. I... I was open for the number one, which is screams, windmills his arms, and falls. <laughs> That is a dumb sheet. I don't like that sheet. The, um, okay. Uh, congratulations. You've gone. Monkey, it is your turn. Continue to basically ruin this room. Number six is, is, is going down this time. Great. Here we go. Come on. Big roll. Big roll. God damn it. 13. No whammies. Uh, and that's melee. Yeah. Nope. 16. Damn it. Um, he dodges. I do your dodging. <laughs> All right. Uh, next up is um, are all of them. Uh, six has popped out a, a tactical baton. He's gonna, he's gonna get you. <laughs> gonna get you, get you, get you, get you. Mommy. So this is melee. All right. Melee. Uh, twenty. Yeah, you got me. Um, and that is. Eight. And where do you hit me at? Um, let's roll for it. He hit you in the right arm. Right arm. All right. Well, I take no damage, but um, he does hurt my armor. <laughs> I'm sure it's like... Fuck! <laughs> right, I just like dink ow, <laughs> <laughs> bitch. <laughs> All right, Jackie Chan stuff after he like ow, ow. Okay. Oh, five's gonna try to shoot me again. Yep, five's gonna shoot you. Um, five, five, all of the stuff that I keep forgetting. 20. That's a hit. Shit. Um, that is f only five damage to your left arm. Left arm, all right. Um, I get no actual damage, but beats up on my armor. You're going to look like Raggedy Andy coming out of this. All right. All right. Four. He was shooting at you before. I don't see any reason to stop. Well, actually, he just saw the guy next to him get shot in the head and killed, so he's going to poke his head out and start shooting out that hallway as well. <laughs> That's a... Zig, he is going to hit you for, oh geez, um, 10 in your right leg. Damn. I've got 16 armor there. Yep, so it doesn't go through, uh, but you knock one point off your armor and it's now 15 armor there. Okay. Okay, uh, and number one, the uh, you've you've drawn a gun, so he's gonna draw a gun, and that is a. But he hits you. The um, 
Because it's you're right on top of each other. No damage. Um, so five damage to your uh, right, left arm. Okay. So that just knocks one off of stopping power. Yes. Okay. Uh, that makes it Dredge's turn. Now you're going to play Gun Fu. Actually, you're out of yep. bullets, aren't so, you? <laughs> um, so my wording was empty the mag, but my rate <laughs> of fire is not the whole mag, so I technically still have three bullets left. You may shoot three bullets if you would like. Three, three yeah, round bursts. I'm going to burst. do uh, burst fire three, mm -hmm. which that operates a little bit differently. Um, if I hit, of it I does. roll a d6 and half it um, right. to see how many hit. Do it, do it. Point so basically roll a d3. Okay. Get rid of the health pools of the dudes that are dead. All right. Uh, I am going to do a called shot for a headshot. Okay. Um, which four. is going to minus four, but the three round burst is a plus three, so it's a minus one. And that means I'm adding 10 to the d10. So let's see what happens. Hey, I didn't roll a one this time, guys. That's a hit. Roll damage. And double it. I got to roll to see how many bullets hit real quick. Okay. Thirty-five of them. Okay. So that's Five. all three. That's all three. That's all three. Okay. Yep, all three hit him. Holy shit. So that's going to be roll for di roll for damage three times and double all of and double the total. Yeah. This dude's head's going to pop clean off. <laughs> pew, pew, pew. Man, why didn't I say the cool thing this time? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's 9, plus 12, 21, plus 13. 34. So 68. that's 34 times 2. That's 68. 68 damage. Uh, his 10 for two. armor for his head. So that's 58. So let me go ahead and... That dude's dead. How would you... <laughs> so his head just pops clean off or do they all just... The bullets just collect on the inside of his helmet. Oh, holy fucking Gallagher, dude. <laughs> That's an old ass reference now. Yeah. I was going to say, was that the. I thought that Carrot Top was the guy who exploded watermelons. No, no it's Gallagher. Gallagher. Carrot Top makes dumb puppets that nobody gives a shit about and then does steroids. The, um... he's, he's a big props, props comic. All right. Dredge has done that. Um, Vivian. Still haven't broken in the room. <laughs> so she's staying, <laughs> she's staying safe. And she's thanking the whatever is out there that she's got dudes who can fight shit. There's, I mean... Dudes yeah, who could fight shit. There's absolutely no reason for her to run through and try and like push her way through zigzag to try and get in the middle of the fighting, and it does not make sense. So she's gonna stay where she's at. You're, doing You're there in case they get past me. Yep. You are doing the right thing. Mm -hmm. Got any envoy shit you can do? <laughs> no. Okay. All right. I don't. Next think up that that's is a thing in this game. we're back to zigzag. I know. I don't. Ah! All right, well, I just got shot in the leg by some asshole who's going to pay for it. Mm -hmm. Hi, Lincoln. Same situation. Close range, aim shot for the head. I need a three or above. No, oh, thank you. What am I going to get? That. Five. Five. 
Oh, yeah. So that's a hit? I don't know if that's a hit or not. There's a baby in the frame. What you doing, Lincoln? What you you have to get a 10, grand total. I don't... I have to get a 10? Yeah, point blank. It's 10. Not with my other modifiers. Oh, you're doing the calculator. Okay. You, you add the modifiers to the... You're doing the calculator. Five. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, if you tell me you hit, you hit. And then damage... 27. 17. These guys should learn not to stick their heads up anywhere. Okay, wild boy. Okay, wild boy. Give me a kiss. Love you, Lincoln. See you later, Lincoln. Have a good night. All right. So, one, two, three, four. This is on the fifth one. I got to look at this again because I don't know it off the top of my head. It's pretty good. Number one doesn't know anything off the top of his head because he doesn't have the top of his head anymore. <laughs> you shoot him right in the helmet. And he drops his head down. Uh, that's what you can see. The people inside the room, Dredge and Monkey, can see that he's alive. Helmets. Tell you what. They're doing work. <laughs> They're doing their best. All right. I'm tired of getting shot at by number five, so I uh, go after him this time. Okay. You do not need to move. Jesus Christ. Zero. All right, I that's, got a, that's, that's got a one. one. Okay, so roll one through ten. To, yeah. One through ten, no modifiers. One through ten, no modifiers. Here we go. Two. Shit. As you swing at him, uh, the blood and viscera on the couch are slippery. This is a, fe a full leather couch. It's pretty slippery to begin with. So you eat it, landing directly on top of two and are laying down. Oh, man. Leather, real leather's got to be expensive these days. Pleather. I said it's pleather. The pleather. All right, all right. Never mind, never mind. Real pleather. Yeah. <laughs> My seat is leather, never mind it's pleather, but baby, we can still ride together. <laughs> lost Laura. Um, okay. That's, it's now their turn. And Six is going to uh, Jump on top of you and try to restrain you while you're on the ground. Okay? Oh. All right. A brawl. Here we go. That is grapple. You are at a negative. Uh, we'll say minus three. Okay? Okay. That works. Due to the nature of your f previous fumble. Um, so with minus three. Ooh, nine. Not yep. so good. He actually is able to... Hold your hands behind your back. Five comes in and zip ties your hands. Okay. So you are zip tied on the ground over there. Uh, four. It's monkey is the one underneath you. Is he is he dispatched? Yes, he is. But okay. I don't know that. You don't know that, but yeah. The um. Uh, four is reeling, but he's still sort of in his, uh, shootout zone. So he's going to unload full auto at zigzag. That is 20 bullets. One is left. Uh, 
that's plus, so that's plus two, point blank, yes, he hits, so that's, um, I need to do calculations actually, 15, 23, 23 over 10, so 13, 13, is that how, the, so 13 bullets hit? He has to get over. It's not ten to hit when it's not point blank. It is point blank. That's ten feet. Oh, uh, ten feet. It point blanks up to up to two meters. Okay. It, there's an actual it, on the basic rules. There's a. I see it now. I see it now. SMGs. Oh, but oh, that's one. But no, it's actually close. He has to get a fifteen. So that's yeah. five less twenty. That's. Um, I'm sorry, I was doing that wrong the entire time. The uh, eight. So. Only eight times. Okay. Um, oh. Uh, that is 25 to your torso. Okay, I have a 42 on torso. Seriously? Holy, Holy shit. shit. Sweet baby Jesus. <laughs> yep. You're armored up, dude. Damn. All right, well, I guess taking 20 bullets, or taking eight bullets to the chest is just a minor inconvenience. <laughs> the um. <laughs> How are you stacking your armor? Holy shit. Well, part of it is the Kevlar T-shirt. Well, there is. Are you doing it correctly? Because there is. It falls. There's off. diminishing returns on. There's layers. diminishing returns on armor. The Gibson Battle Gear denim jacket. So you whatever you want to keep as your main thing, is on top. And is the most underneath and everything on top of that is at half and then a third and then a fourth and then doesn't count. Well then hold on a second. So that would be 10. You said second layer to half half. Is that still 17? Uh, uh, then a third. It's still at, that would make it 20. So you take three. No, okay. five. You take five. Okay, so that's down to 15 then. Uh, you do need to roll stagger, um, which will be, you need to get under your body. 20. So complicated. <laughs> this game, yo. So what'd you roll? Just roll with no modifiers and I can kind that's of what I, That's what I'm doing now. Six. And it's supposed to be under my what? So six plus one because you have to do everything in reverse. So that's seven. Is that lower than your body? Yes. Okay, then you are fine. You are not staggered. But you did get shot. Okay. And uh, because of that, you're at serious minus one. So basically, everything's going to take a minus one penalty until you get healed. Okay. You're bleeding, buddy. Yep. You're bleeding. Uh, Vivian, you would definitely see uh, Zigzag get shot straight in the chest. The um, They are done. Just put a tourniquet around it. That fixes it in the movies. <laughs> on the chest? Uh, the uh, uh, Next up actually is Vivian. Okay. Uh, oh, was that Dredge's turn? No, it's Dredge's turn. How dare you? <laughs> Dredge's turn. I All right, um, have it backwards in my head. Man. I'd see shit going down. Um, fuck, man. Uh, I, I would 
put the I'd put the gun away. Number four is run reloading. Straight. Yeah, I would run at uh, I would run at the guy zip tying, uh, mono, and okay. I would uh, punch him in the face. Put you between four and five. Nuts. Yeah, sure. I'll go between them. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, I kind of assumed. The uh, all right. So roll brawling. I'll take a minus four for the called shot. Okay. Right. Or wait, minus when it's melee, it's only a minus two for called shot. Yes. Seventeen. Six. Jesus fuck! Really? You miss. Um, just barely. Duck. He ducks you. Uh. Now it's Vivian's turn. Where are these shit rolls coming from? Right. Yeah. <laughs> um. And the man in the back yeah, said, "I have three squares of movement, so I don't think I can actually get to zigzag." You could do a full sprint and end up over there. Yeah, but then I wouldn't have an action. But I will do that, and I will try and stay behind the other um, section of the door. This one. Yeah. So hopefully they can't see me. No, you're behind a wall there. They can't see you. He yeah. m- Nobody was looking at that given time, so I, it's unlikely anybody saw you at all. Cool. And then that'll, that'll be it. Okay. Uh, zigzag. A I'm a little pissed. <laughs> so I'm going to take a final shot at this guy. He is ducked down reloading currently. So he'll get cover uh, advantage. Yep. Uh, unless I hold my turn. Okay. And go wait ahead. for him to pop up. Okay, go ahead and hold your turn. That sounds like a good idea. Um, monkey. Um. Dredge has waded in and is being distracting. I am going to... Six uh, is on top of you, basically. Right. Using my incredible strength, I'm going to attempt to break that little zip tie. Okay. Um, I'll put the difficulty at 15. You may roll speed of strength. All right. Here we go. 26. (laughs) Criddles. Nice. Oh, man. He went from fucking Logan to Banner, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now you may nice. take you may take a turn. You cannot move. Um, you, you, you get the choice. Do you want to attack the... Do you want to roll brawling grapple on the guy on top of you or get up? Your choice. Roll uh, grapple on number six. All right. It's BJJ now. This is exactly how I wanted this to go. <laughs> Twenty criddles again. Oh my god. I should roll against that. It's kind of irrelevant, but yeah. Um so I call hacks. You you uh beat him, he had a sixteen. Alright. I'm assuming I've got, I've got that guy grappled. I'm assuming you're still using Wolvers. You may roll an attack if you may roll damage if you'd like. No. Just do a chokehold, actually. Okay, chokehold. Chokeholds work as such. Let me go ahead and read it real quick. Um, after after a hold, which you have done, Indeed. Uh, uh, 1d6 plus damage modifier, and that's per turn till they escape. Yep. My this ignores uh, armor, so as effectively all hand-to-hand does. Nine. Choking this motherfucker out. Go to sleep. So that's uh, fourth one. And it's three. It's, uh, it's not asleep yet. Still fighting. He's he's, he's got. got 
grapple if he wants to get away. So he's got some he's got some jujitsu defense. You can see he's putting the arm in the right place. He's separating your hips. He's doing the good stuff. The um uh okay uh that puts us at their turn. He is going number six is going to try to escape. So he's going to roll brawling. He exploded. That is a 28. Oh, yeah, he exploded. He got, he, he got away. Break, breaks your wrist lock, and he's going to stand up, stand up over here. Okay? All right. Five is going to... Five is going to try to hit the dude who just tried to hit him. That is melee. So, uh... That is 20 on melee. Can I oppose with brawling? No. Because he's using a weapon. Oh, so okay. it's not the same so thing as somebody swinging a punch at you. Straight body, got it. Yeah, he's, he's, trying to, he's trying to hit you with the butt of his gun. You can't really block that. It's going to hurt even if you do. 13. Okay, so he wins. That is... Um, two damage. Okay. Uh, what armor piece did that damage? Um. Well. Yeah. Um. Uh, that hits the left arm. I just realized. I just realized last turn that. Melee is supposed to basically ignore armor, but we've been doing it this way, so. Yeah. Oh, we can change it. It's fine. Okay. Uh, then it's 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 five damage. So. No, it's two damage. Just you took two damage. Because it doesn't matter if we were in Ke- we're in Kevlar. Somebody hits you with a baseball bat. That shit hurts. The um. You know what? I'm fine with it going that way because I'm going to be punching people from now on. So it's a, I would it like a, it's, to it's going it's actually that way. yeah, it's actually beneficial to three of the people in this group. So <laughs> okay, yeah. Sorry about that. No, it's my fault. I fucked up the rules, which is something that I have said. I think every single time we've played this game, the um... welcome to Cyberpunk 2020. <laughs> which I actually feel like we're getting in a bit of a groove here. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so five went, uh, four, uh, is officially reloaded. Um, he notices the guy who jumped in and he is going to try to, um, shoot you real quick. Dredge. Single shot. Does he stand to do it? Uh, yes. Yes. Is it possible for me to take my shot at him the same I time? Absolutely, it will, will allow you to do that. Uh, He'll still get his the... shot off, but you'll be able to shoot him. Okay. Actually, no, he stands before he shoots, so you are allowed to take your action before he does because you have held with specific thing. So okay, I've got the serious disadvantage, negative one, so add that there. So I need a four to hit. Okay. Is that a four? Got a four. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Roll damage. Uh, damage then is 22. Is that a call shot on his head as well? Yep. Okay. And that's doubled already? That's that's doubled already. Okay. 22 that, that, damage. That's the total. Is there any point in me adding to this? One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's actually impossible. He is dead. How? What happens as he stands up? <laughs> oh, let's find out. And he really loves those overacted death rolls. 
the the one advantage oh. of the like reverse thing for the body modifier and stuff like that when you're trying to roll for save at a certain point if your body is low enough there's just literally no way for you to do it right. unless you explode on a 10 there's no way for you to get past yeah. it so so he he kind of mumbles to himself crumbles down like a rag doll yeah you dredge you just hear freeze <laughs> and I'm like looking at the guy in front of me, so I, I like probably don't even notice the guy behind me die. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Um so that's all of them. They're done. Zigzag, you've taken your last turn, so you can take your next turn now. You can take this turn. All now. right. Uh, I crouch. No, no, that was your last... Sorry, no, not Zig, Vivian. We need her back. Okay. Dredge. Dredge has a higher... Dredge. It's listed right here and in order, in. and I keep fucking this shit up. No, no it's all right, it's all right, it's all right. All right, so... All right, let me think here. Cool okay, guys again. don't watch NPCs act in the With background. With the cold shot for the punch in the face, that is... Um, Minus two. Plus the... Yeah. yeah. Right. Right. Oop. Almost lost him for a second. Vivian, you're up next. Okay. Excellent. Not, um, not, not right I... now. Next. Oh. Sorry. I was just having oh. you prep. Night. All right. Uh, 19 brawling. Okay. You will probably succeed here. Yep. He had an 11. So, roll damage. Yep, on it. On his head. Uh, you go ahead and double. All right, that's double and eight, so 16 to the dome. 16 to the dome. That is sixteen. Okay, that puts him uh three. Oh, it rolled very well. Doesn't knock him out. Hurts like hell. Definitely, probably broke his jaw. <laughs> he rolled a one. All right. <laughs> That's what you're going for with the body roll. Okay. Um, uh, Vivian. Okay. Um, what I want to do is attempt to administer some first aid to Zigzag. Okay. First aid is a skill, I believe, under tech. Mm-hmm. I'm trying to find where, like, how that heals in combat. Uh, I don't think it heals. I think it stops bleeding and stops um, health degeneration. So The healing okay. thing is med tech, which is a whole class that you could take. Yeah. So. Okay, so that would really essentially do nothing then. Yeah, first aid allows the user to bind wounds, stop bleeding, and revive a stunned patient. See trauma team, page 116 for details. Okay, so never mind. That won't be helpful at all. Um... <laughs> well, you just saw Zigzag take another dude's head off. Do you want to get in the room? Um, no, I'm going to back up and still continue my plan of being the, like, last, last thing between them and Seeker. Behind the couch? Um, in front of the couch. That'll, yeah. Does that make sense to you? 
with my one, two. Can I go catty corner one more backwards? One, two, three. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, that is zigzag then. Followed by monkey. All right. So uh, I crouch down because I still don't know it's quite on the other side of that door, and I work my way to the door. You're not hearing gunshots anymore. You're hearing, like, struggling. Oh, well, shit. Then I'm just going to go on and try to step through the door and see what the hell's going on. Okay, you're going to need to roll athletics to get over your pile of garbage. I guess I was responsible for that, right? <laughs> it basically was all you, man. It was all of you. You just found anything that wasn't bolted down and some things that were, and you just started throwing them in front of the door. Uh, my athletics is 11. I'll give it to you. There's a pile of garbage he needs to get over, and there's a bunch of debris and, that he left and, there to stop the door. Yeah. However, uh, you, you won't be able to do an action because you're basically going to trip over the bodies. Well, yeah, using my time to get through all that crap, I imagine that I wouldn't have gotten in a... Mm -hmm. So you're in the room now. All right. You're, you awkwardly stump, fall into the room through the broken door. Um, okay. Uh, monkey. Is standing up a full action, or is that considered movement? Uh, movement. But you cannot move after that. Um, and I'm right next to, to six, right? He's just right there. If I, yep. if I stood up, I could attack six, right? Sure. Then that's what I do. I'll stand up, thrusting my, my wolvers forward as I do, using my massive thighs to generate as much force as I possibly can. <laughs> um, using my body weight and strength. So, here we go. So that's brawling, correct? It is uh, melee. Melee. Wolvers are melee. Okay. Seven. Oh, I'm sorry. Fifteen with. Uh, Sixteen. God damn it! He dodges. This guy. This guy. <laughs> You've met him, man. You've met the guy. Yeah. All right. So he he takes out his baton and he's like, "All right, all right, let's do this." <laughs> Melee, uh, 15. God damn it. Okay, he hits. He does. I can't roll for shit. Um, and he hits you in the chest, stomach area for... Five. Just right in the stomach, as hard as he can make it go. Wow. Roll for stun, I'm yeah, assuming. Out to be stunned, yep. Okay. Erotic fiction cross fighting crossover. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Erotic fiction happening directly in front of you. I'm not stunned. Okay, nice. Not at all. That probably just irritated me a little bit. Really? Well, did you do it in reverse? Because it's it's minus, but it's actually plus. No, yeah, that's what I did. That's why I've got a minus, uh, minus one in my roll. <laughs> okay. I rolled low and then minus my body type. So. Oh yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Minus your body type. Okay. Honestly, a lot of fighting games are kind of like that. It's true. Um, okay. And then five is going to use his baton on Dredge. Dredge, that is melee. Nineteen. This is devolved into just purely trying to kick the crap out of each other. 
Uh, okay, 11. Uh, he hits. That is a lot. That is 10 to your left leg. Okay. I forgot. That should be mitigated by body, right? So, like, it's, like, two less because my body type's nine. Oh, yeah, that's true. It should have gone the same for... I don't know what your body is. Uh, He's clearly paying. He's clearly paying right now. The, um... Okay, so uh, it's eight to your left leg. Um, the wounds don't seem to be like located, but I mean that puts me at, uh, I mean that puts me at serious wounds. Okay, so you will roll for stun, which basically means does he drop you because he hit you in the leg? All right. Um, fuck, remind me what I need to roll for that. So it's going to be your body plus, if you're in serious, it's plus one. You're just going to roll a d10 plus one. It needs to be less than your body stat. Nine. Okay. Is that so less than your body stat? My body stat's nine, but I didn't do any modifications. There's a plus one, so that's uh, so, so that's a ten. Yeah. So I'm, I think I'm stunned. I'm yeah. not sure. Clips your knee, drops you to the ground, and you'll lose your next turn. You'll get to roll again on your next turn for it, but right now you can't do anything. Um. Okay. Uh, that takes us to zigzag. Nope. Dredge. You can roll right now. Alright, what do I roll to get out of stun? Same thing. Okay, that's lower now. Okay, so next turn you can actually do stuff. Okay? If that makes sense. Okay. So that's like a compound fracture in my fucking tibia. <laughs> uh, yeah, you'll probably be able to walk, but it'll hurt like hell. The um, uh, Vivian, mm-hmm. you have heard Dredge basically yell. You heard everybody yelling. You saw Zigzag. I yelled in there. a steady stream of cuss words, <laughs> some of which are new. <laughs> I will come down to that corner where the entry kind of opens. Right here? Mm Mm-hmm. Okay. And is that just what I see? I see Zig and Dredge. Um, Looking through, you would probably see Zig trying to get his bearings, right? Because he just slid down the open door that's been thrown forward. And you'd see this dead guy over here with like, a, and a ladder on the floor, and, <laughs> and like probably a decent amount of blood all over the place. Okay, okay. And the, all that pile of shit is still in front of me. The the elevator door is probably trying to close, but it keeps hitting the ladder and the dude. Um, I'll hold my stance. <laughs> God, it's probably making that annoying ass noise. <laughs> There's a lot of annoying noises happening right now. I don't think you would pay attention to that particular one. <laughs> the, um... <laughs> dude, bars, Soul Calibur did things to me when I was a kid. The, um... Okay. You all... Um... It is now... She is gone. It is now Zigzag's turn. You just saw five drop dredge by basically cracking his kneecap in half. Um, Monkey is in a knife fight for his fucking life on the other (laughs) side of the room. (laughs) And probably very sweaty and bloody. 
What do you do, bud? Uh, yeah. Thinking even though Dredge is just being capped. I'm actually going to go for the knife fighters. Aiming at six. Again, aimed headshot. Okay. Minus four. four. You got to get a 15. You're not point blank. You're doing. You're using a pistol, right? Yeah, but I'm close range. Yeah, you're close range. You have to get a 15. I'm looking at and it right my, here. Right. And with my other modifiers, this thing is telling me I only need a three, but then I have to add the negative one. So I need a four. Okay. So roll it. Yeah, essentially, you. you're saying if you roll a four plus your modifiers, you will be at 15. That's what yes. So. I believe you. You're using the calculator uh, we found a long time ago. So, yeah, I just believe Yes. You. Yes, that is correct. Yeah. Okay. I believe you. Hit it. Nine. Hit it. Okay. And you're listed as close range in that calculator, right? Not point blank? Yes, close. Quarter long range. Okay, thank you. Um, the uh, That was a cold shot in the head. Go ahead and roll damage. He's already kind of beat the hell. So, <laughs> so that'll be eighteen altogether. Eighteen. Two, three, four, five, seven. Uh, that's one minus. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, how do you do it? <laughs> John, uh, y'all got John Wick wandering through this fucking room right now. Let's see. This is a, he just slumps to the ground moaning. Catch him in the neck. Yeah, yeah these overacted deaths aren't too overacted. <laughs> Am yeah. I supposed to overact them? <laughs> Yours will be better if without even trying. Yeah. Jump in the line. Lock the money. Um, okay. Well, then I turn around and bury my claws into number five. Okay. There's melee. God damn it. I'm going to give you a plus one because he's not paying attention to you right now. Twelve, then. I got to roll for his shit when I fight it right now. Uh, m You miss. Um, because he's taking care of Dredge, he's going to swing at you. Melee. Melee? Yeah, melee. Uh, 21. God damn it, still hits me. Fucker. That is minus your body. That's going to be 11 to your, whatever your body modifier is, it's minus that. What's your body modifier? Uh, my, my, like three or four? It's um, in this case, it's three. Be, um, three. Okay, so that's uh, I think. So that's eight to your chest. Again, they just keep hitting you in the fucking stomach, dude. Rolling for stun. This is a little bit easier for me. Yep. I am not stunned. I am hurt, though. Okay. I now take a minus to all of my shit. Minus what? I take them. Um, I'm at a point now in inside of my damage where I'm take. I take a minus two to. That's everything that I do. That's a lot. Ooh. You're a crit. Yeah. All right. So you need to kill this dude. <laughs> <laughs> All 
Okay, uh, that um, is the end of that. So that is going to be the no oh, uh, dredge. Dredge, you are no longer stunned this round. Yep, I I like get up after clutching my knee and just swing right at the guy's jaw. Um, be a called shot plus plus the minus two because of being in uh, serious wounds. Right. So I add twelve to my brawling. That's twenty. Yep, uh, way beat it. Alright, 2d6 plus 3. And it's double because it's a headshot, so 24 damage to the dome. Uh, you kill him, how do you, how do, you do it? There's no way. Yeah. Uh, after he goes down, I just don't stop. I hop on top of him and just keep punching as blood splatters everywhere. Because I'm fucking pissed. After a few of those, um, you kind of slump over tired. Look around the room. Yeah. The action has stopped, and basically this whole room has changed color. The, um... (sighs) The fuck? So what now? Done yet? Your your role playing. I'm gonna I'm gonna ask a stupid question. Is everybody okay? Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> Monkey's definitely got some cracked ribs. Uh, yeah. Uh, are we done? Can we go home now? Yeah, I think we better check on Seeker, see how far yeah, she's me, gotten. Let me go check. Um, who had the key? Did you take the key, Zig? No, I think I th- you did. I think I gave it to you. Oh, okay. Yeah, I got the key. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'll run back and I'll unlock the door. Hi. So, how's it going? She's got her keyboard and one of the monitors pulled underneath the table, underneath the desk. <laughs> it's all clear for now, um, but we probably need to go relatively quickly. How's it going? Good. I think it's working. Uh, I haven't heard from Elena in a while. I think she's gone. Gone how? Well, I had to plug her into the system, right? And so I plugged her into the system, and this system has backups upon backups upon backups upon access, and all of a sudden, uh, she just stopped responding. Um, all right. Uh, explain... As if you were talking to someone who doesn't know what the implication of that might mean. Internet open, uh, internet, internet lady gone. So, like, internet lady out in the web. I think so. I've been trying to find her, uh, tracking uh, some code patterns that existed Uh, yeah, I think she's just gone. Right. And scary version? I don't know. I have no idea. Also gone? I, I don't know. I don't know. All right. Next question, do you need to be here to continue monitoring? As long as they don't destroy the hardware of the servers, no. I've put a hardware loop that'll come back to us. It, they could potentially find it. If they do, they could pull it out or backtrace it, but I, I hit it pretty deep. 
It's it's all I can do. I, it's what I got. I think that that's probably what we're going to have to go with and just hope that they don't find it. Um, and hope that if they do, that Abuela's is the, like, super tank hideout that I think it is. Um, but we actually really should go. We should We should go now. And you should completely just ignore, close your eyes, hop on my back. I'll give you a piggyback ride um, as we leave. Um, uh, one, no, I got one thing I got to do first. She walks out into the hallway and just starts firing shots into different rooms through windows and stuff like that. What you doing? Because this is a glass home, if you remember properly. Mm-hmm. It's kind of look like a break-in. <laughs> I'm fairly certain anyone who comes through here is not going to believe that it's a break-in. Um, also, I'm pretty sure the news will cover up whatever it is that happened here. What the actual fuck? <laughs> Why is there still shooting? <laughs> it's Seeker! You're fine! <sighs> okay. Okay. Uh, can we still use the elevator? Um, it's actually conveniently here. Just waiting for us. It might be a bit frozen. We might need to give it a couple punches. Um, but conveniently, Dredge has propped it open with a ladder. Why does Dredge have... Okay. He, she starts heading that way. With you, But I, I actually mean it. Like, hop on my back and close your eyes. Oh, okay. And know that whatever I'm walking over, I didn't do any of it. Oh, God. No, 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 no. There's, there's a second elevator. There's a second elevator? Yeah, yeah, in his bedroom. In the, in the shower. Oh. Can't hear anything you're saying right now. Can't hear anything you're saying right now. <laughs> Are you on push to talk? Um, I, I told her she lost her mic. Okay, uh, I'll try unplugging it. There you go. It. Yeah, that there works. You. Don't know what the hell happened to my USB microphone. Yeah, we just lost everything you said after she oh. it told you about the elevator. Um, I just yell, boys, there's an elevator. Back here. I head back, start heading back that way. You all do your best to get over the uh, barricade. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. But, uh... I help him over with the best of my abilities. Shit, he's hurt too, though. Yeah, you're all kind of bleeding. Y'all yeah. look like fucking shit. But I'm probably the least hurt of the three of us. It's true. Holy shit, what happened to you? Get What the fuck? I told you to close your eyes. Uh, uh, okay, it's ba uh, bathroom back here. It's a glass bathroom. It's so gross. Why? Yeah, who does that? Who does that? Fucking is that the one with the yeah, Even I think that's a bad idea. What'd you, what'd you say, Zigzag? Is that the one where the glass fogs over when you close the door? <laughs> I don't even know. Get the fuck out of here. You all, like, cram yourselves into this shower and barely fit, right? <laughs> okay, there's a control... Okay, I got it. And starts to move down. Kind of odd. Do I want to know I mean, it's not what you idea. guys did? Uh, some, like, security goons showed up. There was, like, six of them breaking in. They were here when we got there. They didn't buy our story. <laughs> Forget about us. What about, what about Elena? I don't know, monkey. I th she escaped. 
but she's out, right? I mean, yeah, I guess so. Now we just gotta hope she, you know, cares. Wait, like she's all out there on the wide interwebs? Yeah, but she does have direct access to Project Alpha from here. I did too for a minute. We should try to talk to her again now that she's like got all that access, you know? I can't. She's not. Thank you. She didn't respond. <laughs> yeah, give it time. She'll come back. You guys smell bad. You the door open the door opens behind you as you stop, and you find yourselves in a uh, garaged portion of the parking garage. There's three stalls. One of them's empty. One of them has a, uh, one of them has a large, van. A large what? Van. 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 A large armored van that looks very similar to that one that you got from Dietz. And a brand new 2045 Lexus Infinity. <laughs> Who's got those keys? Um, I have keys. Does it got one of those little clicker fobs? Sure shit does. Beep boop. <laughs> Can I drive? Absolutely. You know you're going to have to hose the seats down when you get out, right? I was going to say Dredge sure as hell ain't going to drive. All right, let's pile in. I'll sit in the middle in the back. That seems fair. <laughs> I can't even get it out of the parking lot. My ribs hurt so bad I can't even fucking steer it. All right. So no, else. no, no, no. Here's what happens. Here's what happens. You roll a one, okay? I did. You turn it on. You put it in gear, and you drive directly into the wall in front of you. <laughs> oh my god, monkey! All of the airbags pop. Somebody else drive. Oh, Jesus. Fucking. Fix the fucking airbag. I have a knife. I have a knife. Seeker gives you a knife. <laughs> gives you a little boot knife. <laughs> pop it. Pop it. All right. I stab the airbags. <laughs> I get out of the driver's seat. <laughs> what the fuck, monkey? Ugh. Uh, shit, which one of my knees is fucked? I think I got whiplash. Ow. Uh, left. Zig, Zig, can you drive? Of course okay, I can drive. Nah. Zig's got it. So, yeah. you, so you're going to take the All van right, now. I'm not giving up, I'm not giving up <laughs> shotgun, though. It hurts too much to walk. Now, so, we'll just, we can still drive the, the Lex. we just give it to... I'm just going to give it to... Abuela. Abuela. She can fix it. Yeah. I might recommend reverse. God damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, why do I gotta sit next to Monkey? There's no room! Ah! <laughs> fine, I guess me and Mono can switch. I'm fine. It just, it hurts. Thought so. Just I'll switch just... over a little bit and you'll be more on my lap than under Monkey. That's not safe. I need to wear my belt. You can put your seatbelt around the both of us. We're like Kate Moss times two. <laughs> so like three-fourths of a normal person. Exactly. I rolled a ten for driving. That'll get us there. You very slowly reverse. You're 
pulling out of the garage. There must be something about the car because the gate opens before you get there. And lets you out. We should, should probably we be, figure out we, where that is. Yeah, we should probably be concerned that they could track this car pretty easily. One hundred percent. Just get us somewhere other than here. Don't don't go back to a place. Just get us somewhere other than here. I'll take care of it. Just find another. Park Are we getting the van back? Something. I, I mean, I only ask because, like, I, I I left like you know, I don't know everything I own in it. How far away did we park the van? I don't remember where you guys parked the van. Oh, it was like in that garage structure, just like outside the door. Somebody keep Monkey awake. You may be going into shock. Monkey! Mono. Slap him. Mono. She pokes oh, okay. you. Okay, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to check on Mono. Uh, I'm going to... Is he bleeding? I can... If there's... Not externally. We got to get him back to Boyos. El Pronto. El Pronto? Fucking racist. Just. All right. I drive to the van. Okay. Because we got to get out of this car. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, monkey, get out. I can't literally move you. Move. <laughs> I get out of the car. Uh. Um, when we get okay. back to the van, is there anything I could do for him first aid wise? You can monitor him on the way back. That'd be about it. All right. Monkey, I need the keys. Pocket, pocket, pocket. All right. Uh, All right. I get him the keys. Okay, for the van, I roll a nine for driving. Okay. You're going very slow. You're very worried. You're not. You're not used to stick. It's a little weird. The um. <laughs> You only grind the gears a couple times trying to get up to speed. The um, as you're leaving, notice awareness. Everybody, not monkey, probably. Is notice awareness affected by injury at all? It's a, everything's affected by injury. You're in pain. Yeah, I, yeah in, you have to take right. that stun negative. All right, then that's a nine. Twenty-four. Nine as well. Seeker's kind of doting over Monkey. She looks pretty worried. Twenty-four. Mm-hmm. Zigzag, you're focused on the road. Dredge, you're worried well about. As well as I should be. Dredge, you're worried about your friend. Um, Vivian, you see that there are multiple, when you look back down the street, you can see all sorts of police pulling in to the building. Well... This will be interesting. Isn't it always? It is indeed. There are lots of uh, police officers heading into that building right now. I'm just glad the blue boys aren't following us. It's true, but there were plenty of cameras. I wouldn't worry too much about that. I I got rid of pretty much everything. You are the fucking best. <laughs> I 
There is a decent amount of DNA evidence. Right. Right. Uh, knew we should have dumped ammonia on the blood. I didn't bleed, though. Should have just set fire to the floor. Uh, it's pretty quiet on the way back to... Thanks for the raid, Sparrow! Hey, thanks for the raid, Jax. Sparrow! I hope your reading went well. I'm gonna have to go back and watch them, because I'm super into that book. Oh, hi. And Sparrow... Hawkner? Hawkins. Hawkins. Okay, I had to look at the other jet. The, uh, <laughs> I couldn't read it. <laughs> I couldn't read it. Uh... This TV just the it does not show up very well on the big monitor in front of me. Um, Sparrowhawk NZ New Zealand. Yay! The um, okay. It's pretty quiet on the way, way back to Abuelos. You get your you get back. Uh, you get back. It was very late, early when you arrived. Sun's probably coming up by the time you... At least peaking. By the time you get back to Abuelos. Are you holding up there, monkey? Uh, yeah, I, just, uh, I need some ibuprofen. Yeah, man, we're, we're almost there. We're almost there. Just hold on. Pulling into the shop. Uh, Abuela is waiting for you. She looks tired. Mm. Real quick, thematically, after he said that, I feel like I would look for an, uh, just like a painkiller in my bag. Would I know enough to know that you don't want to give someone a blood thinner when they're bleeding internally? You can roll... Uh, intelligence or tech. It's a med tech ability, but... Probably tech, honestly. I roll first aid for that. No. It's a med tech, a med tech thing. You would roll tech. First aid is a tech skill. It's not first aid. It's a med tech thing. There's a skill called med tech that you have to be a, a, me, a medical, a med tech to have. Alrighty. Rolling with a modifier of one. Nine. Um, no. You would not know that. It's okay. No, don't worry about it. No, no, it's good. Uh, it's making a really bad joke. I just need to just get me somewhere. Yeah, it is a really bad joke. Why are you fucking with us? Babe, do you still have Erica's number? I do, though last time she talked to me, she was not super enthused. But I think in this case, it's probably best to give her a call. Yeah, she's got a job just like, just like we do. And I will call Erica. One ring goes to voicemail. That's about what I thought would happen. You get a text back. What? Not even spelled all the way out. W A T. <laughs> uh, monkey is really hurt. Cut his legs off too.
no firefight as we were trying to save the goddamn city from the AI that wants to take over. But, you know, hold on to things that I didn't do. <laughs> I'll meet you at Abuelos. Thanks, THX. It ain't free. Obviously not. Okay. You arrive at Abuelos. Again, uh, the, uh, she opens the door for you. She looks very tired. Clearly been waiting up. Where the hell have you been? Oh, shit. You guys got fucked up. Yeah, you should have seen the other guys. Yeah, I think I do see parts of the other guys sitting all over your fucking clothes. God damn it. Buenas mañana, abuela. Mañana, shithead. All right, come on. I still got that... That's why I said. ...med area up. Uh, some broken ribs. Uh, I ate broken ribs. You should get rid of ribs. I did that. Yeah. Oh, don't make me laugh. Oh, God. Be uh, easier to suck your dick. Wow. <laughs> uh, wow. But I don't think that would help. Honestly. Oh. <laughs> Did you guys hear that when you were kids, too? Like, that Marilyn Manson removed his dick? <laughs> Removed his ribs or whatever. Removed his ribs so he can... Yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember that rumor. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Seeker, baby, you okay? Set. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. You! She gets right in your face, Vivian. You were supposed to not put her in these situations. She was in a completely steel-locked room when this went down that I locked myself. And if you'd have lost the fucking fight? We didn't lose. We don't lose. I mean, we don't look great, but we didn't lose. I don't need snark out of you, sweet cheeks. She goes back over and starts helping you guys get to the medical area. Uh, Erica shows up maybe 10 minutes later. I get monkey situated and walk out. Erica shows up. Holy crap, what did you guys do? Zigzag, you were fucking shot! Oh my god, sit down! I'm alright. Kevlar took most of it, but, uh... Can't say <sighs> it doesn't hurt a little bit. Okay, 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 okay. Everybody, pick a table, lay down. Monkey, what's wrong with you? Uh... Got, uh, broke some broken ribs. Dredge, outside of psychological, what do you got? Uh, my left knee hurts. Your knee hurts. Your knee hurts. She comes up and starts, like, grabbing your knee. Uh, you mean your... You mean your leg is broken. Fantastic. That's what that, that's what that means. Uh, fuck. That's... that's Where's the blonde one? She dead or what? The blonde one. She left. Vivian left. Oh, did she? Yeah. No, uh, no, she wasn't in the scrap. 
Uh, yeah, she held back and she was protecting Seeker. Well, at least one of you isn't shot to shit. Oh, God. I didn't get shot. Well, I mean, I did, but it didn't go through. Shut up or I won't give you pain pills. Or pain injection. <laughs> she needs to roll a med tech three times. Okay, um, best she can do for you, monkey, is give you pain meds and wrap your chest. That's all anybody can do. She's pretty sure you don't have bleeding after taking blood pressure and um, just monitoring you. She ends up monitoring you for about 12 hours to make sure you're not getting blood poisoning. And you're, she thinks you're fine. Zigzag, she thinks it's best to not take the bullet out. It's just going to be in your shoulder. All right. You know, it's not the first time I carried a scar. A, scar. a little souvenir. She stitches you up pretty nice. You're good to go. Dredge, you get a cast. She throws a bit of rubber on the bottom for a walking boot. You're going to have minus one movement while you have the boot on, okay? Okay. She gives both zigzag and monkey pain meds. She flips off dredge fairly heavily and then walks away. I mean, that was nice of her, but it was also kind of, you know, rough. I think she was flirting with me. Hey, you've got some problems. <laughs> really? <laughs> what have you been doing, Vivian? Um, she just went back to I think she probably would have walked around for a while just up and down the hallways um, and then probably would have wound up in Seeker's room not the computer room but the room room right Seeker's hammering away on her computer how are the boys um I'm sure they're fine. I got them settled in before Erica got here. Erica seems pretty good at her job. She'll, they should be okay. Yep. I'm sure they're fine. What's wrong? Hmm? What's wrong? <sighs> I mean, outside of the getting shot at and shooting people and the entire city might be bad and I let loose and sentient AI or human soul or whatever copy clone into <sighs> there's um it's just the inevitable knowledge that nothing we do matters and nothing we do will help and everything we do, try, we just fuck it up more, no, no. and all of this is our fault. And you try to be a good person, or well, you want us to be a good person, but you keep getting dragged into shit, and I can't protect you. She runs across the room and gives you a big hug. I don't want to do this anymore. Uh, 
What if we didn't, then? All our shit's turned off. Did... I mean, I'm not excited about turning a blind eye, but we don't have to. Help. But I do. I feel responsible for all of the shit that went down. I mean, zigzag, he, he's my cousin and he's paid to follow me around and protect me and so he would do what I told him to do. The other two, I hired them to be part of a club and then Dietz walks in and just fucks everything up and I... I'm responsible for all of this. This is my fault. No, it's not your fault. It's... Shitty circumstance. We... Listen, this past time with you guys... I've seen horrible things. I blew up my own house. And I killed a dude. Which I've never done before. But I've also lived harder than I have ever lived in my life. I was afraid to go outside before I met you guys. And now I'm afraid of probably right. <laughs> and now I'm afraid a crazed human soul is going to break my brain. Okay? <laughs> the, the perspective has changed a bit. <laughs> Listen, it's just we just nice to have a win. <laughs> and not feel like everyone hates you. But we don't know we didn't win tonight. I don't think anybody hates you. Erica does. Abuela does. <laughs> Abuela's mad at everyone. Also, she does like you. She hasn't tried to kill you, which is... <laughs> she might, because I took you somewhere and couldn't protect you, but... You well, know. I'll tell her to shove it up her ass, okay? And Erica... Fuck it. If she can't see it wasn't your fault, then it's her problem. Controlling dredge is like lighting a couch on fire and then figuring out how to sit down. <laughs> I think I'll just sit in here for a bit. I have tequila in the nightstand. <laughs> Thank you. Do you want to lay down? I'm kind of tired. Mm hmm. Cuddling ensues. All right. So it's going to take a few hours for you guys to get wrapped up properly. And then you'd probably want to sleep. So, do you want to mm. cut to the next night or the next, just go all the way to the next day? Because Erica would definitely, there would be morphine and monkey and zigzags future. Oh, yeah. I'm not going anywhere for a while. I got I got pretty deep into crit. Into Prob crit. Probably so. some for dredge as well, but she would be yeah, but he did knowing who choice. you are. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> it also didn't seem to do anything to him when she gave it to him. <laughs> Too high of a resistance. <laughs> Is that all you got? <laughs> you gotta hit harder than that, kid. The, um... Oh, come on. Come on, uh, come on Erica. The, the walls aren't even melting. That's not the goal, asshole. 
I'm just fucking with you. It's fine. You did what you could. How much to get a hold of some healing drugs or some nanos to speed this up? Jesus Christ. I hate broken ribs. I hate them. I can... Uh, I know a guy we can do... They're expensive. I know. I'm, that's why I asked how much, you fuck. I'd have to call, okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's cool. Call, call. Anything is better than this. Yeah, I know some cred sticks you could use. <laughs> Don't laugh, man. Don't laugh. That hurts. That shit hurts. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah, use those things. Vivian will pop her head in. I uh, could call on a few favors. I'm not going to say no. I'll say thank you. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to say no. Um, I'll call in my resources to see if we can get some nanos. Shit. Okay. Does anybody know exactly how healing works? I'm having trouble finding it. Okay, um, so with with the med tech's care, one he wound heals per day. Yes. With just successful first aid, it's half a point per day. If you add the speed healing drug into that, which costs a fair bit, uh, it adds another point of healing per day. And with nanos, you could potentially stack it up to three points of healing a day. And they're uh, it is like not you. <laughs> painstakingly so how much is, slow process. So how much is, is speed healing cost? Uh, I think it was like a little over sixteen hundred EB per. I'm assuming. Yeah, for the yeah drug. per dose. Yeah, per treatment. I could afford one treatment with my own with my own money, but um, as Zig said, there's. Uh, some cred sticks. Fucking healthcare in this country, right? I rolled a 21 for resources. Um, you're informed by um, your dad's cousin who... Not Uncle Patrick. Not please. Uncle Patrick. Not Uncle Patrick. Different guy. Uh, we'll say female. Who knows? Aunt Patricia. An uh, sure. An Anita. I was going to say Anita, but... Anita out of Seattle. That um, she knows of a seller in Night City. Can get it for base value, the 1600 Um... But it's not a great, it's not like uh, you're not getting going to get a buddy relationship there. Oh, right. Oh. It's not like an all the time supplier, but a, they do something nice for us for one time. Right. The nanos are slightly cheaper. It's 1500 a dose. They're rare. They're only available in like one of 10 hospitals. No, I think the I think the drugs would be easier to find. So, yeah, speed healing drugs are easier to find. So yeah, it'd be the sixteen hundred. You have more than enough money, but it's still up in the air whether or not you could use that money. Well, let's see. Red things should only track to the where you use it. As long as we're not going to stick around there, it's fine. You know what? And I bet a boiler has a way to launder that shit anyway. That's a great point. We'd have to get her, give her a cut, but it would be worth not getting, you know, shot again. Let's do that. Uh, let's do that. Monkey, you said you had enough for one. I have enough for two. Here. My creds are in my, uh, creds are in the, in the bag. So I'll put in an order for three. I give you the 
1750 that I have, I am now wiped out. No, you just give me 1600 darling. I don't need the 1750. I just give you all of it. You can pay me back if you need to. Whatever you need. Get what you can. I'm sorry, this is out of character. I wasn't doing the math. What does that put your timetable of recovery at? Uh, full recovery. That'll um, it still it would still be a while. I need uh, I need four days or four points just to get back into serious. I'm right at the edge of critical. If that dude fucked me up, mm -hmm. <laughs> fucked me up. So with one dose, um, I can take two days to get to get down into just serious wounds. With more doses, I could, you know, obviously. Okay. Okay. More. It's a, yeah. It's, I'm I'm only at like I'm at eight overall, so I'll probably be able to get by and be at about. I'll be back down to light at least, even if we leave in a little less than a week. Without the use of any drugs. Zig, where are you at? Uh. I'm two points into serious. Okay. So without any help, Zig, it would take Zig six days. Nah. It would take Monkey almost two weeks. The full heal, yeah. And take Dredge basically a week. Yeah. Eight days. So if we planned on staying a week I think to speed it no up no one finds us and we give Monkey all three then he would be healing around the same time that you two would. That means do nothing for a week. Unless you do it on your own, Vivian. Somebody needs to find out uh, what's going on with the Elenas. Okay. The secret thing, anyway. When these arrive, because I set up the delivery of all three, um, when they get here, Monkey, you take all of them. Boys, you stay in Heal up, Seeker, and I'll handle this. You're the boss. Yep, I'm good. Oh. Hi, guys. <laughs> oh, we can see the mic all again. Get rid of that. I'm like way behind on my backgrounds and shit that I just totally. Close oh. my heart and I hope to. Combat, huh? <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Did you have a good time, everybody? Uh, the. Bugs, yeah. Uh, out of character, I thought it was very entertaining. Uh,. Dredge was is not amused by what happened to his leg. Okay. Um, Vivian, you get a hold of the... Do you want to roleplay that out? It is very uneventful. No. Okay. I just... Like the medical people? Yeah. Yeah, I just tell them when to send it and yep. send the cred account or whatever. Yep. Pay for it in full, so it's forty-eight. The um, uh, um, Erica is over the next week. There are three more blackouts. Zigzag. The message is that you get. 
are. Let's leave. Just let's leave. Tomorrow doesn't exist. And then the last one is garbled nonsense. might have saved the world. Oh, do, do we assume that he tells us about it? I of course guess. I'd tell you about it. I don't know. I mean, I'm not like on a need to know basis for everything. No, I'm just... And during that time, I would have been constantly talking with Seeker to see what she's monitoring and Seeker um, can't find her, but what she has been doing is she's been putting up uh, dummy websites and pinging off of different IPs all over the city that are co encoded with what few things she learned about a uh, um sorry what she learned about Elena mm -hmm. like um, a uh, um, Elder Scrolls uh, fan page dedicated to this one city and it shows a map and the map is wrong it has her house in it that she built um, it's a uh, Marvel movie fan page dedicated to exactly the movies Elena had seen only the ones she remembered she'd seen um, she starts one that's an auto insurance claim and it, uh, at the beginning of every every third word, spells out her name over and over again. It doesn't. It reads like a. It reads like a children. A child wrote it, but she did her best. Mm -hmm. And she's just hoping someone sees it. Do you think, um, and I'm sure you're you're doing this as well, but potentially if if the I don't want to call the bad Elena and good Elena, but if the original angry Elena either convinced or forced good Elena to go with her or forced her out, uh, if potentially good Elena is also leaving these kinds of Easter eggs? I suppose that's possible, but I don't... I don't know where she... I don't... Hmm. I can look into it, but I don't really know what I'd be looking for. Um, I mean, the first thing she said to us was the chess opening move. What was the move? Might be a place to start. What was the move again? I can't remember. Knight to E4? Knight to... E5. It was a Potter reference. Right. Mm-hmm. Okay. Knight to... <sighs> I am officially looking the entire internet in the city for Knight to E5. Okay.
What was the name of the bad guy in that one? In Harry Potter? Lord Voldemort? Oh, I thought he had like Laura a... Laura Sunbridge, she's worse. I thought it was Tom something? Sorry, what? Tom. Tom Riddle, wasn't it? Right, Tom Marvolo Riddle. That's his actual name. God, I'm a nerd. Yeah, it's it's hot. Whatever. The um There's a Tom Riddle. Tom Riddle that just Oh no, I missed it. Oh fuck, I missed it. Where are the boys? I'm not she just takes off she just takes off running. Oh god. I follow her. I gotta assume we're just watching TV, eating um, <laughs> Jello, because you're because you're in. <laughs> we're all just on the like on this couch, just like chilling. Like I'm in my boot. You guys are all still bandaged up. Well, I guess we would probably be getting. Out. I'd probably have gotten the boot off by now. But uh, it'd still be like bandaged and stuff. Abuela walks into her apartment and goes, I said no dredges on the couch. (laughs) (laughs) Now, I I would say, sorry, I'm I'm interjecting this a little bit, but like over the course of the last week, we probably would have looked into getting our gear repaired, right? If there wasn't somebody in house, we would have like, Tried to find somebody. Yeah, you could have gotten it repaired. Uh, monkey's broke, but... I gave him back what I didn't need. Which wasn't much. But was... I should I should point out that we have $89,550 worth of credits that need to be cleaned. <laughs> so. Yeah, we should cover that at some point, but not right now. <laughs> Wants we to. can do a time. We can do a time warp to say that you figured that out somewhere okay. during the week, and we'll talk about what that means after this short conversation. But, okay. Yeah. Um, you you just hear, monkey, monkey, in here, TV. She throws the door open. Monkey, Tom Riddle. Who? Good. Give me a fucking remote. I big brained. I big brained. I thought of something and I something happened. Yeah. Well, we- I mean, we were watching Jeopardy. They only mentioned Tom Riddle last week. She plug she plugs into the side of the the monitor and switches to the correct input. Tom Riddle. And it shows you a page of a guy who is middle management for the news and it lists him as a director tom riddle okay he's Uh, oh he i was okay i was trying to keep an eye on the vps right because we have all these cred sticks and shit like that so i'm like well what if some of some else go missing or whatever the hell so i was just like basically looking at everything This guy started work the day Elena got out. The day of the shooting. He started that morning. Tom Riddle from from Harry Potter. He's the bad guy. Jeopardy music is currently playing in Dredge's head. She's sending a coded message. You were right, Vivian. She's Tom Riddle. Mm Mm-hmm. So Elena is running the news. No, 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 no. You look into him, he doesn't exist. This is the only page for him on their public site. Look, look, there's nothing, right? You can go through their their, their, uh, accounts payable, and I have. There there is no Tom Riddle. But he showed up on this site as an employee. Yes, their public site. Their public web page. She made it as easy as she could to let us know something. I don't, 
I don't know what it means, but it's something. Who is Pepe Sylvia? <laughs> Okay. This is, this is a Harry Potter thing. Um, Holy right, shit! I really thought. She said to us. <sighs> okay. Yeah. The first thing she said to us was night to E five. It's a Harry Potter reference. She admitted it's a Harry Potter reference. So, yeah. I, I, I when I was looking through the the managers and VPs the other day, I thought it was weird that they said they had hired a guy, but they've never paid the guy. I think maybe he's, maybe he's out of the. Maybe he's not, you know, being paid yet, but maybe he doesn't exist, monkey. I completely get that. It's, it's, it's absolutely, she's telling us something. I don't know what she's telling us. Okay. I suppose we should have watched those movies while we were laid up. I mean, I've watched all of them and I've read all the books. Uh, it says Tom Riddle is, uh, this picture is a total fake. I've deconstructed it already. None of this is real. It's just stock footage layered over some bullshit background. I mean, you would do it for any made-up ID or whatever, right? right okay. Right. Um, says he's a middle management director, does the 6 o'clock news. Uh, okay. Perfect. An identity just uh, yeah, in, in, in the middle of the road. He's, uh, he's right. Basically invisible. Even if he was real, he'd basically be invisible. Notice awareness, everybody. Wait, 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 wait. Fourteen. Fifteen. Fourteen, fifteen. Um, uh, explosion, okay. Um, Twenty-two. 29. Uh, also 22. 14, 15. Looks like a guy standing in front of some buildings. Which is actually strange if you pull up the site on your own stuff. Everybody else is standing in front of like a splash background. But this is somebody standing in front of like a buildings and stuff. They're out of focus because he's in focus, but that's what it is. 29 and 22. 22, Vivian. That it's, we both got 22. Oh, you both got 22. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, 22, both of you. Um, one of the buildings he's standing in front of is Project Alpha. You can clearly tell. Mm -hmm. And that's half of the background. The other half is a building with a green sign that you cannot make out. And there's something wrong with the gap. You remember Project Alpha. You remember the entire outside of that building, right? You mm -hmm. obsessed over it for weeks. There was, there's a big gap for um, the shipping, the, for the, um, uh, not shipping, but the, uh, the incoming equipment and stuff like that, right? There's a big ramp there. The ramp mm -hmm. is gone. Basically, all of that's cropped out, and this other building is shoved right next to it. Right. We've, we've been there. Uh, We've been there before. That wasn't there before, was it? Was it, Viv? No, this other building with the sign that we can't quite make out has been, like, overlapped on top of the the loading bay. What do you mean, you've um, been there? What? Well, this one's Project Alpha, this building. But this other building has been moved in the background of the picture. And I think the message she's trying to send, the picture is a location, and this Tom Riddle's in charge of the six o'clock news, so she gave a time and a location. Oh, shit! But I don't know this other building. 
A fucking team high five! She started. <laughs> Sorry, what? Slap hands! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> Trench! <laughs> Zig Zag! <laughs> you get kisses! <laughs> the dream work. All right, what's the green sign? I, I don't know. But it's it's a real sign, right? It's not a digital one. It's attached to the building. We have to be able to find a sign, right? Can you enhance the photo at all? This isn't CSI. No, I can't enhance. Yeah, that, oh, yeah. you can't just go yeah. like enhance. Do, 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 do. enhance. Not real, enhance. I enhance. can make the pic the shitty pixels bigger. Is that what you want? <laughs> not a real thing. Um, it really isn't. <laughs> Google searching businesses with green signs. Uh, the lettering is, she's staring at it, Vivian and Dredge, you would both be able to tell that it's yellow lettering and it looks like there's some red or something in there too. Yellow and red lettering. Zigzag, go ahead and do. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing the uh, reverse Google image search. Okay. Gotta be a thing. Uh, but like, I cropped it down to that section, so it's I would not like you to, to pull roll, in the other information. I'd like you to roll tech. Uh, fuck me. Uh, do, 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 do you have any tech skills whatsoever? Oh my god. Let's yeah. see. Patty's pub? <laughs> is that a green? <laughs> is that true? The, the only other thing that might help is streetwise in case he saw it somewhere. But uh, otherwise, my tech roll is a, it's a 10. Uh, go ahead and roll street si streetwise. Oh, add streetwise? Go ahead and roll streetwise, since he thought... Oh, I can roll streetwise to find this no. out? No. Okay. He can oh, roll I streetwise, because he chose to. That uh, makes it a 17. The Patty's Pub joke actually made sense. <laughs> On the way there, you recall, you recall, it opened probably four or five months ago, but they did a recreation of the Always Sunny in Philadelphia bar, like three blocks away from that location. You, you, you went once. It was fine. It's a franchise now. Yeah. It's a, it's a, Still better than Pennigan's. That would be so fucking awesome. <laughs> it's a perfect recreation. Everyone's really mean and shitty. You went in. It was fine. The beer was okay. It didn't make sense for how much it cost. But you remember, like, a few blocks from there is that bar. Zigzag. So, uh, hey, guys. This is like a... It's, it's like a bar. You remember that... Uh, what's that one show? You know, it's a... It's a, it's a there's a sunrise in some city. I can't think of it, but but they they, they have that franchise, that 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 bar place, you know. Uh, that's what I think this is. Cheers. No, not that one. Not that one. Not that one. Yeah, it's it's always sunny in Philadelphia. Remember? I mean, remember any of that, you guys? Any? No one. No one. No one. No. Am I the only one who has like? Like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah! Like where where all the people comedy. are really, really awful. Like they make me look like a good person. Yeah, it's pretty much it right there. A little while ago, a little while back, they had the they had this grand opening thing. That's like they they remade it to look like it, like the pub from that show. I think that's what this is. No shit. Why? I mean, it's an easy cash grab. I mean, you know, you just franchise stuff off of something that people are familiar with. You know. According to the Google search, there's 42, most of them in Asia. But so, why, why it, this pub? Oh my God, those, it's the answer. I don't know. We got a we got a place to go check. Is that at six? I mean, that that's what we got. We got a place to check. We got a place. We got, we got a place. We got a time. We got a time. Do we have a date? Maybe it's every day. Could be every day. I mean, maybe he stops there on a regular basis. 
Six o'clock every day. Not an odd time to be at a bar. All right. Well, we've got something. She's sending us there for a reason. I suppose we're going on a... We're going out, I guess. Happy hour? How do you feel about going out? We haven't been out in, like, days. Well, you don't have to fuck my ass to get me out the door. Ew. Thank you. I just... This, yeah. so I don't many think any of I... us were thinking about that or wanting to, but now you've put it in our brains. Oh, it's a, it's a fucking turn of phrase. Chill Is out. Is it though? Is Thank it? you very much for watching this week, guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, have a good night, everybody. Great job, everybody. Uh, we'll be back Sunday with a distant star. Uh, they are in the middle of some ruins, and, uh, there are snakes. I'm uncomfortable. <laughs> Rainbow is uncomfortable. Next. Um, the... Rainbow doesn't mind. I haven't gotten the end of, uh, end of last week's episode, because I don't know where you guys are. Um, uh, and then be back Wednesday and Thursday. Thank you very much for watching. Have an excellent <laughs> evening. See you next week, everybody. <laughs> Good night. Internet. <laughs> 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 <laughs>